Hey guys and welcome back to Maverick Productions. Today I have another interview. Today with Eduardo Pincelli. He plays for Ethniki Achna in the Cypriot second division but has been playing in Cyprus for a numerous number of years now. Eduardo, how are you? I'm fine my friend, thank you. Good, okay. So uh, we'll, we'll, we'll start off with the first question. You have been in Cyprus for majority of your career. What makes you want to stay in this league for such a profound period of time? Short. I mean, year round. Uh, it's my eleven seasons here, uh, so I think the the level it's it's good, you know. Uh, also about quality life, Cyprus is a great place, especially uh, when you have a family. So very safe. The league is good. The level is okay. So uh, it's very pleasure to be here. So that's. Why I'm here. Yeah, it's a pleasure to have you as well. How different is the first league in Cyprus compared to the second league? To be honest, uh, the numbers of foreigners makes a difference because in the first league they are allowed to have 15 foreigners and on the second league only six. Really? So mm. yeah, so I believe that this makes a difference and it's a um, relative difference between the leagues. Ah, so that means if a team gets relegated, they have to sell a lot of plays, right? Yeah. The, the players here, they, they have on their contract. If the team relegates, the contract is finished, you know? Yeah. So the team can plan, they are able to plan better about the second league. Yeah. Do they uh, count Greece as um, foreign as well? Yeah. No, like, uh, on first league, they, they should they are allowed to have 15, yeah. five with uh, European passports, yeah. if you, you are Greece you can't count as European, and the second league six, four as European, and two uh, all around the world, you know. Ah, okay, so you count as European passport as well? I, I have, I have a uh, passport. That's, ma oh, that's good, um, okay, so the next question is, um, what's your ultimate football goal? decide to to see step by step on my life so this year my target it's uh, to to help to bring Athena not myself to bring of course with my teammates to bring my club to to the first league again this is my my own goal for the season okay that, yep that, that, that sounds reasonable I interviewed Olympiago Nicosia and they said the same thing if you could change one thing in football, what would it be? I think it's a lovely game. Uh, I'm a Brazilian guy, so this football is in our blood, in our, in our DNA. Foot, on football, it change nothing. So it's nothing in the how it be, you know? no rules like in the Cypriot league specifically. Like you wouldn't change the number of foreigners that come into the second division or. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I agree too because uh, this, we want the Super National team to reach the World Cup but they can't because not many of them are playing in high levels of football because um, they don't get the chance to. Yeah, exactly. And I believe it's the country. It's, uh, even if it's Cyprus grows up about the tourism, yep. they used to have foreign people a lot here. They treat us foreign people very well. Cypriot people normally they are very good. Mm -hmm. But it's their country, so they, they need to use their country, their league, their football to improve. Of course, to bring foreigners uh, brings you some good quality and also to improve the Cypriots, but not too many like should was before, you know? Yeah. 
And last question, do you have any advice for any footballers? I believe to be honest with them, with them teammates, to be honest with themselves and uh, special today that the football is most physical and technical all around the world. Uh, the numbers say that. I believe to work hard and to uh, have to work hard and to every day to to try to be better. It's uh, the best advice I can give. I I say that it's more physically because you know, like if you compare ten years ago, the players run eight kilometers a game. Well, wow. they, they run thirteen, fourteen. Mm -hmm. So. As the time is passing, you'll be it's being more athletic game, more physical game than only technical. Yeah. All right. Um, thank you very much, Eduardo. That's um, that's all for me today. And thank you guys for watching this video. Be sure to buy all my my merchandise and. We don't don't forget to subscribe to Marvel's Production.